Now it's time to map crypto transactions to your QuickBooks chart of accounts. Gilded needs a dedicated account to store your digital asset holdings. And under this account, Gilded will create sub accounts for each of your digital assets like Bitcoin and Ethereum. We recommend calling this primary account digital assets. Now before continuing, you'll need to create this account manually in QuickBooks. Or you can use this auto configure mappings button to create it directly from within Gilded. Let's try that now. The only change Gilded is making to QuickBooks is adding the digital asset account. You can always delete this account from QuickBooks later if you decide not to keep it. Now we can see the digital asset account is created and mapped in Gilded. Let's go check that in QuickBooks just to verify. So I'm in my chart of accounts and here is one called digital assets. Perfect. Moving back to Gilded, we've also mapped income, expenses, fees, and gain and loss to separate accounts. Now you can customize these mappings to suit your needs. Gilded's pro version gives you greater control over how wallets and other crypto transactions are mapped. And if you have any questions about mapping to your chart of accounts, don't hesitate to contact us using the chat bubble below.